In this video, we will show you how to replace your ignition coil on the Chevy Malibu with a 2.5 liter engine. You'll have four of these located under your engine cover. Let's get into it. A quick note, the process for one is the same for all. Okay friend, let's get started on our job. To remove the engine cover, you're going to have to remove three T27 torque screws. Once all that's removed, continue on to your engine oil cap. Take hold of that, turn it counterclockwise and remove it. Give the seal a quick inspection and set it aside. Take hold of the engine cover and carefully remove it from the vehicle. Let's take that engine oil cap, start it right back in place, continue on with some compressed air along the top of the engine. Now that we have that done, let's continue on to disconnecting our electrical connector. You'll find that you have a small red locking tab here that restricts this from being depressed so you can release this. Use a small pocket screwdriver and carefully separate this area. There we are. You just need to push it back far enough that you can dislodge this. Squeeze in on this area with your thumb. A quick inspection for corrosion and we'll set that wiring aside. Use a 10 millimeter to remove your mounting bolt. Take hold of the ignition coil, give it a little wiggle and lift it up and out of the engine. There it is, friend. Okay, let's get ready to install our brand new ignition coil. When doing so, we want to make sure we add a thin amount of dielectric lubricant down along this port here where it will sit on the spark plug. Let's bring this down into position, sliding it onto the spark plug, aligning our mounting bolt hole. Start in that mounting bolt, bottom it out, and then torque that to 89 inch pounds. Torque this to 89 inch pounds. Double check to make sure it's completely secured in place. Time to reconnect the electrical connector. Press it until you hear a click. Make sure you lock it in and then confirm that it's completely secured in place. As I said at the beginning of the video, the process for one is the exact same thing as all others. Let's remove the engine oil cap here. Reinstall your engine cover. Reinstall your engine oil cap and install all three of your mounting bolts. Bottom them out and snug them up. Confirm your engine cover secured. Okay friend, we've got our vehicle back together. At this point, hop in the passenger compartment, start up your vehicle, let it run for a little while. Make sure you have no check engine light and no running condition, close the hood, and take your vehicle for a road test. Thanks for watching. When only the best will do, demand TRQ. The only company that lets you view before you do. TRQ is committed to offering the highest quality aftermarket auto parts that are engineered for peace of mind. Thanks for using and viewing with TRQ.